Hey guys, I'm, we're gonna be doing a color changing milk experiment. All right, so all you guys need for this experiment is a little thing of milk, some food coloring, okay. and some dish soap. We decided to also get some heavy whipping cream because it has a higher fat content, which we'll get to later, to do as well with the milk. So what we need to do first, and Mia's gonna be my assistant, we're gonna put um, a couple drops of each color into the milk. So why don't you do the red, Mia, and I'll do the green. Okay. So many. one, two, three, four, five. Go ahead and do five. One, two, Spread them out. Three, four, and five. Good head. And go ahead and do that one while I do this one. It looks like I did green, actually, not blue, so you could take care of the blue. Excellent. Let's do the same thing over here with the heavy whipping cream. This one, two, three, four, five. Not sure how that one's going to work out, one, so we'll see. One, two, three, four, five. Maybe you do that one. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, actually. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so practically six. What we're gonna do now <laughs> is we've got the milk and we've got and we've got the food coloring and now we've got the dish soap. So we're gonna squeeze a couple drops of dish soap in and see what happens. Ooh, Ooh. cool. Pretty cool. That's awesome. So the reason that you see that happening is because milk is mostly water but it also contains vitamins and minerals and proteins and little tiny droplets of fat. And the fat acts sort of like <clears throat> oils, which means it doesn't mix with water. And dish soap is the same thing kind of as the oil. It doesn't really mix with the water. So when we put the dish soap into the mixture, the dish soap grabs on to the fat molecules in the milk and separates them from the water and the um, food coloring molecules and does a sort of little silly dance like you saw and makes a really cool looking <clears throat> colorful scene in the milk so what do you think is cool about that mia i think um that the cool i have two cool things mm -hmm. that um i like the part where it like explodes into like the whole thing of milk and mm -hmm. i like the part where it has these like small scale looking things mm -hmm. of the colors Awesome. Let's see what happens when we do it to the heavy whipping cream. Doesn't really do anything. Not as much happening in that one as we have with here. An extension activity you guys can do is you can try different kinds of milk. We use 2% milk. So if you guys want to try it with like whole milk or 1% milk or skim milk, you can tell us if you have a different reaction than we got with the 2% milk. Thanks. 